beautiful morning. What a beautiful morning. Mary quit burping. It'd be even better. Good morning. Let's go do some dumpster diving. Anyways, we'll see you at the next one. First one. Next one. Whatever one we get to. First. We just got the weirdest Ulta score in a lifetime. Yeah. Like, someone must have dumped their trash, but it was all stuff you guys was, will see when we do the haul. It was all useful stuff, which is really weird. So we're at Ross, and uh, we but we did get two diff boxes. Um, that was just threw me for a loop. That was so weird. Anything. No. no, you can tell when there's damage boxes. kind of stranged out. That took way too long. We'll go check Bed Bath & Beyond. But that was really weird. Like really weird. You guys will see and you'll be like, what, that came out of the Ulta dumpster? But it did. There was a bunch of toads. Yeah, we got Family Three new totes. Well, not new, but new to us. Bed, bath, and beyond dumpster. Man, our windshield's dirty. Oh, but check out what we did find. Look at this baby. BH Cosmetics. Nothing wrong with her. You... Yeah, and one that you don't have. That's really nice. Yeah. It was, just it was just laying there. So that was cool. Got my shirt dirty. And uh, I'm going to have to spray and wash it because it's this light color. So that sucks. But oh well. That's the price you pay dumpster diving, especially in this color. I don't know what I was thinking. So we will go to PetSmart now. So we'll see you when we get there. PetSmart dumpster. <laughs> Aaron fighting with the birds. He's laughing at me. You little bastard. Keep laughing. He's a scared. What is that? Poop. Looks like a big huge fish tank pump. You look like a big fish tank pump. Do I? No. No. <laughs> well, it looks like they did the cut and destroy. Yeah, it's a big marine land one. We can't see. Oh yeah. Not sure if it works. Still got water in it? Yeah. You want it? Sure. One thirty two. Filters. $132? Someone tagged it out? Yeah. Hell yeah, I want it. Um. That goes to it. Well, take it. I can't. Why? Because the camera. Give me the camera.
strange individual. I feel something. back later. Oh yeah? They're mad at us because we moved their food. Like he answered you. Silly bird. What are those birds called? I don't know. Scissor tail fly catchers? Wiggers? Wiggers? No, I think they're scissor tail fly catchers. Don't move their food where they can't get to it. I feed off this all day, all week. Well, yeah. They're hungry little birdies. Hold on. Listen here. We are busy. You can have your food back in a minute. Here. That goes to that. Oh. Fish tank eater. The only time I've ever known this store to cut their bags is when the food's been recalled. Sitter feeder. Oh. Give me that sitter feeder too. This? No, this. Sitter feeder? Sitter. Yeah. That's what I mean. Cat toys. Oh, I can play with Aaron with this. Careful with that fish tank heater.
crap. Right here. That's not really but it'll still sit up. Got a little ball. Let me pop the trunk. That was not sounding good. We shall go check staples. I'm just going to let Aaron jump out real quick while I check the battery. If there's anything good, I'll turn the camera back on. See you in a minute. That's for my truck. That's so good. For PlayStation? I doubt it so works. Yeah, it's wet. buttload of speakers another toad is this a yes that is a tripod it's broken it's yep it's all bent up My battery's flashing again. I don't think there's anything good in here, guys. What's that bag? What bag? Oh, it's sliced. I need that. Don't rip the box. Oh. Sorry about that, guys. I had to locate a battery. It like slides. It's a toolbox? Yeah, I'm keeping it. That's awesome. There's one of these that's like this. So this has got high screen too. Oh, wow. It's pretty cool. Oh, wow. And then it opens here. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. That's one of these guys. It works right here. I don't know why you can throw it away. Take that. Cause that those ones you just trade them in, they're only sixteen dollars. Okay. All right, guys, we'll go to CVS next. Or where next? CVS? Uh, 
either that or Pier 1. One of the two. We'll see you at the next one. How about that? Pier 1 dumpster. <laughs> he gets so disappointed when he doesn't find anything here. It cracks me up. Because he never finds anything here very often. It's a work here one, but I'll never buy anything from it. They are so expensive. It's like $80 for a stupid lamp. I know, right? And then like probably like thirty dollars for a bowl. Yeah, it's really insane at this one. So we'll see you at CVS. CVS dumpster. Except for Aaron's got a hot dog. Hold it. Come on, we Sicko. Dirt dumpers. Dumping some dirt. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I gotta get to my appointment. So if there's no truck at the Dollar Tree, we will go there when we're done. Ooh. If there is, then we will see you when we get home. Guys, we came out to eat for dinner, and so we just stopped by a couple dumpsters, and we're at Petco, and Aaron just found this huge critter cage. These signs are leaning up against her. See the picture of it? I'm probably gonna have to set that camera down. This thing's heavy. We got it in. Holy crap. Look at it. It's not cracked or anything. We'll check it out more when we get home. I can't imagine what that thing is worth. Oh my goodness, what a good score. We will go check Bed Bath & Beyond as well. 
Um, no, I usually get the chance to check it at night. That's when we usually have stuff. Like yeah, that. we haven't been to this town at night in a cool minute. But um, we'll go check it out. So we'll, we'll see you at the next one. Yeah, Dollar Tree and CVS. Yeah, Dollar Tree and CVS. So we'll see you at the next ones. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Welcome. Anyways, we got a little haul for you guys. It's a strange haul because this stuff came out of Ulta, but it's not makeup. Not all of it. Not any of it. Not all of it is from that Ulta dumpster. Oh, no. Not all of it's from the Ulta dumpster. Okay. <laughs> I was like, wait. Not any of it's makeup. Someone must have dumped their trash in there and, like... It was good stuff, so we grabbed what we could use. So, I'm going to give you a little overview, and I think we got some stuff from PetSmart as well. Yeah. And so, I'll give you a little overview, and then we'll get started. Ready, set, let's go. Wait. I also wanted to say, um, this footage may be a little bit mixed up with the next video, because we have a huge tank here, and I'm pretty sure that we got it in the second dive. But it's like the only thing we found that day, so I haven't decided whether I'm going to use that footage or not. So we just threw it in with this haul. So if you do end up seeing the footage of it, that means I decided to use the video. You'll see it in the next one or the one after. But we do have an Ulta dive for you guys, and then we have a, a haul in the car. So stay tuned for those two videos because those are coming up real soon. And let's get started. Pardon. All right, so first things first, we found this at Staples. Was it Staples? Yeah. And it's just like I said, someone threw their trash away, and it's even still got tools in it. But it's a toolbox. Someone left some of their tools in it, so we got a cool wrench and a cool toolbox. Which we could always use, because we do have tools. And it's a nice one too. It's got nice metal clips on it. And then here's the tank we're talking about. And we, Aaron just bumped into me really hard. <laughs> we found this at Petco and it is a deluxe critter cage. And so it's really big and it's got the um, wire mesh lid. And it says something, but anyways, it does have a minor crack right there but I figure that we'll throw it in the yard sale for 30 40 bucks and people might want it because if it's just holding a snake I would think that that's not gonna hurt anything wouldn't you guys comment down below and tell me what you guys think cuz if you guys think the snake could strike that and break it then we might as well just go ahead and toss this oh. but if it's if it's for like a frog or a turtle or something, you know, the, I think someone could get some use out of this. Even yeah, with it's not supposed to hold water. one edge cracked right there. They could put that edge up against the wall or something. And then they have a perfectly brand new still in the box tank. So there's that. And then from Ross, we found, er, yeah. yeah. was this at Ulta? Oh yeah, it was. This was at Ulta, and it was from someone throwing their stuff away, and that goes like this, like the other one. But isn't that cute? I can get so many uses out of this. I love finding totes. And then there was these two little containers, and there's still some zip ties in it, but we can always use little containers like that for screws and whatnot, so we grab those. And then... Perfect. You know what this is? No. Ice maker line. For the fridge? Yep. Really? This was out of the Staples dumpster, I want to say. Brand new. It is brand new. I know. I just said that. And then this was also in the Staples dumpster. And then that goes with that over there, so just set that down there for now. And then on sitting right outside the Staples dumpster, oh, Aaron got all these for his truck. If he work. wants to put these in his they truck should. if they work. 
Um, you'll see from the footage the dumpster had quite a few speakers that someone had thrown out. And then we found this thing with it. And we can always use those. I like to use those for my Ulta hauls outside. I like to put my makeup in it and just rinse it off because it goes right through it. And then someone threw away this propane tank. And here, where we live, we have these, like, um, little metal buildings outside. They're cages. Cage that hold, the that hold the tanks. And you can just go and purchase a new one and put the empty one in there. And so, even though this is empty, all we got to do is go swap it out and buy a new one. And now we have a tank. So... Like, we weren't leaving it behind, because we do have a grill. Feels like it's got something in it. And it might have some propane in it. We'll have to check it and see, but... Yeah, that was... St Why would someone throw that away? That's stupid. And then there was two of these totes in the Ulta dumpster. And they're very nice, heavy-duty totes. And we can always use totes for um, our storage units. So there's there was those two. And they're identical. They're just stacked on inside of each other. What is this? It's a pump. For what? A bike. Oh, it's Look a bicycle it. pump. I didn't know. How would I know? This is, these are tubes for tires. For oh, bicycle tire tubes? I don't know what the hell We don't is. know what this is, but we think it's some kind of fishing gear gadget. Where someone wore it around their neck and like, see the fingernail clippers on it and... The Gucci box. All that stuff. What's in it? Feels hard. There's nothing in it. Absolutely nothing in it. Oh, well that's trash. Who cares if it's a Gucci box? Or unless they sell, I don't know. Some little headphones. Found a little pill container. We're going to throw the pills away, but that's cool container. Could put earrings or anything in it. Little wire. That come in handy for crafting. An air chuck. That's not an air chuck. What is that's, it called? That's the tire. Air pressure. That's the tire pressure monitor. Yeah, air tire pressure thingy. Another frame. Which was in the old to dumpster. You gotta pop these out. And then we found this at Petco, and it's a feeder for, um, like, gerbils, rabbits, guinea pigs, stuff like that. Here. And then a cat toy. So, we're not sure if this was in the Ulta dumpster because it came from Ulta. Or if it was thrown out with that person's stuff. So, but it's brand new. We got a dog toy. My mom's dog Annie will love this. She loves to play fetch. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, these are um, card stock. There's 50 count flat cards and envelopes. So, brand new. You can write what you want to on them. Or design them however you want to. We have a $35.99 aquarium heater. So we'll plug that in make sure it heats up before we list it. Okay. Don't throw nothing on top of that. I'm setting it right there. We got two bags of Iams dog food. Small bags. Oh yeah, these were sunglasses. More these were in the are. Ulta dumpster. Or safety goggles or something. They were in the Ulta dumpster. A bunch of hair ties and clips and whatnots in the Ulta dumpster. Always need these in Montana. Brand new shaving cream. This was all in the Ulta dumpster. A whole bag full of fishing line, so we'll be using that when we go play at the lake. 
Okay, so sorry about that. that. Here's this frame. Really pretty, really um country chic or whatever. And then there is some um, moose. Like I said, some really odd stuff, but a whole bag of spices. And that was in the Ulta dumpster. And another whole bag of spices was also in the Ulta dumpster. Someone just threw their stuff away. A thing of envelopes. Oh, this I'm pretty certain is out of Ulta, but um, I think it's a cologne. It says YSL, but I don't know if it's men or women. It's got a bow, so I would think it's women's, but it smells to me like men's, which is really weird. I don't know. So I'll have to look that up, but here's that. And then Aaron found some more cable ties. What are they called? Strap. Straps. And then there was some laundry soap. And this is almost full. Some clarified butter. Some butter. Some Listerine. Listerine, brand new. Cool. Uh, tinted um, sunscreen. Two little bottles of that. Now the Clinique, I'm pretty sure, oops, came out of the Ulta dumpster, but it might not have. It might have been in their stuff. But it's the clarifying uh, lotion exfoliator, and then a Tresemme hairspray. And then Beach Babe. I think that this Not Your Mother's and the Clinique and the perfume came out of the Ulta dumpster. That might be where it feels chunky in there. Nail hole filler. Still feels really full. No, it's not ruined, baby. Still squishy. Another Clinique. Take the day off. Oh, I've been wanting to try that. Brand new toothbrush. Uh, sandwich bags. Can never go wrong with those. Some of that stuff you wrap your arm with if you get hurt. Rivets. Some rivets. Good for crafting. And I do have the tool for these. Oh, these are uh, for... Um, I have no idea what these are or what they're for. They go to the edges of like shelves. Like on the edges. Of glass. Battery cleaner. Earplugs. Yeah, they're like plastic moldable earplugs. I've never seen such a thing, but... They look brand new. Some batteries, a screwdriver, some tools... And then a bunch of pins and sharpies and this other tote. Some screws and and then at PetSmart. Here, just throw these back in there. At PetSmart we found this huge pet I mean pet um fish tank filter and it goes with this hose right here. And the tag on it says $123.69. So I'm not sure what kind of tank it goes to or how we're going to test it. But usually we just plug them in and make sure that they turn on. But this one actually looks a little more complicated. So I might have to do some YouTube research on it. Make sure it's all here. All that good stuff. But yeah guys, that's our haul for today. So that's not too bad. Comment down below and let me know what you guys think. Not bad for free stuff, right? Alright, you guys, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Uh, YouTube sends me a thing every month and shows me how many thumbs up we get and how many shares we get. 
Guys, we only got 47 shares. Please share our videos. Help us to grow. And um, don't forget to click the notification bell so you get notified every time we upload. Hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you in the next video. We love you guys. Bye! He's still waving. <laughs>